product life cycles are shortening, as I've described, um, companies have to be ever quicker at bringing new products to market. So frankly, the question we're asking here is, um, what should our strategy look like um, when the pace of change is increasing and when the future is more and more difficult to uh, divine and manage? Strategy is less important and tactics are becoming more important. While we're not saying that companies should abandon vision and mission, we still believe that vision and mission is an important part of what we do as organizations, uh, leaders also need to develop a greater sensitivity to what we call peripheral vision because it's not necessarily going to be the direct competition which leads to substantial problems for a company strategically. It's going to be people that do not appear to be competitors right now but who could suddenly become competitors in the future. I'm pretty sure if you'd gone to Detroit 15 years ago and you'd asked most of the senior executives in Detroit who are going to be your main competitors in the car industry, they probably would have talked about Korea. They probably would have talked about Japan. They would definitely have talked about Germany. But very few of them would have said, oh yeah, I think a technology firm based in Silicon Valley is going to produce cars. And what Peripheral Vision teaches us is, let's keep looking for those, those peripheral threats uh, that could go from being a very much side bet to a core, core business.